Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. The city of L.A. and a developer are sued over a proposed multi-million dollar development in Hollywood. I'm Robert Olguin. Coming up, we'll tell you what the lawsuit is alleging. Five opponents of the proposed Millennium Skyscraper project in Hollywood have filed a lawsuit to try to stop it from being built. The multi-million dollar plan includes a 35-story and 39-story tower on Vine Street near the Capitol Records building. Eyewitness News reporter Robert Olguin has the details of the lawsuit. For some, they represent a vibrant future for Hollywood. For others, the Millennium Towers represent a dangerous and disruptive change in their way of life. The concentration of development in Hollywood will make life unbearable for the residents. We're already prisoners in our own homes. Today, the community groups that are opposed to the Millennium Towers filed a lawsuit to stop the project, alleging that the city and the developer have intentionally misled the public about the risks associated with building high-rises over what they say is an active fault line. This is is an expose of City Hall and City of Los Angeles mayor misconduct. Robert Silverstein is an attorney representing the opponents to the Millennium Project. This is a magnum opus describing a culture of secrecy and rule breaking by City Hall and the City Council that elevates the interests of well connected and well financed developers. Last month, LA City Council approved the concept of the development, but the lawsuit filed today challenges the legality of the city's approval process, alleging that the seismic risks associated with the area were purposely omitted from the environmental impact report. The project team is working with the state and the city before any permits are ever given. Councilman Mitch O'Farrell, who represents Hollywood, has long maintained that more seismic testing will be performed before any building permits are issued. And City Councilman Tom LeBonge says these kinds of lawsuits are just part of the process. So there's a, now a court case that will be set in a docket. They'll lay it all on the table and there'll be a determination, hopefully, that's right for everyone. We were not able to make contact with the developer, Millennium Partners, which is based out of New York. The mayor's office said it would not respond directly to the allegations made in the lawsuit, but a spokesman for Mayor Eric Garcetti says the state is currently conducting seismic tests on the proposed site. Reporting from downtown LA, Robert Olguin, ABC7 Eyewitness News.